if you want to climb to like a higher rank, you got to start be think you got to start thinking about the mind games and stuff. Where we go? Going right to bottom white. See, if I see this, if I see this on my screen right now, I would immediately not go bottom white. I would immediately walk down here or or something. I, I need to take up something else on the map. Um, because I see like three, two people already going here and it's like pointless to stack with them. Um, it'd be such a huge investment to go into bottom white and, and you don't even get anything really of value on this map. Because like, if you think about it, what is in bottom white? There's a BR on the top and then like, you can barely even see anything. This is Koth, and you know the hill is going to be here. Um, and you want to take up this side of the map. Camo is optimal as well, but if you're in bottom white, um, even if they take bottom white, it doesn't matter. They can't. They, they have like a really hard time of getting into camo because you have. If you guys go into gold right now, they they can only come out through like these big open entryways. Like they can only come come up through top here. Um, on the seaside, they they have like this big open area. I'm sure you guys know the map. Um, but yeah, you have a lot of cover on the gold side but you have like one really crappy place on this side so immediately on this i would just not even go this way like um i see two people already going here leave it to them man that's that's their that's their thing um i'd go immediately to the camo or something or even um go in the middle right here but yeah i would immediately like do something else because three people into bottom white bad investment not gonna lie it's like okay you guys get bottom white, cool. Um, and uh, fundamentally, I would say it's kind of wrong, but like, you know, this is whatever rank you're in, probably like, I don't know, diamond, like low diamond. You're in this rank and you guys can just like outkill. So it's like whatever. But fundamentally, you don't want to be doing that. The thing is, was this investment really even worth it? You guys got camo and stuff like you guys wiped their team you guys got camo but guess what you guys are all in the middle of the map so where do you think they're gonna spawn they could spawn anywhere you know i, I wouldn't even call this a good investment they could spawn up here they could spawn up here and they can spawn at a you guys are all in the middle of the map so you just basically gave your team just basically gave up map control for camo um, camo is not even a guaranteed anything you know what i mean Okay, well, anyways, this is like a really cool like um web app that somebody in my discord like developed <laughs> right now You guys are in the center of the map. So like I said, you guys are here Enemies could be spawning here 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 um, like Literally anywhere in these zones your teammates are gonna spawn here um, and you guys got the camo good for you but like you know the hill is here you guys have to invest so much um to fight back for this hill and all you get out of it is a camo because nobody else went on the other side of the map or one dude did um and he immediately got wiped fundamentally i just think it's a poor investment they get the they get the hill time off of this camo is like useless you guys won the fight and then you lost the hill like what is the point <laughs> you know you have to fight for all of this you know it's just a really bad investment and you won't know this um until after uh you're like wait how do we win the fight and we lost the hill this is so weird um, and this is a really huge investment i wouldn't have done this you need to live up two of your teammates are dead you're not thanos but good at this point in time you should not be cross mapping. No, sorry, you have no, you don't have like the luxury of cross mapping right now. Um, you need to be taking up space on the map right now. You need to be getting out of this spot. One, because you're going to be infinitely spawning the enemy team closer to the hill. So for one, get out of this spot, go A or something. I would say just go right into A. Like you cannot be cross mapping right now. This is super bad because you guys are not, you're not winning. Enemy team um, took the hill. And see, like, a guy just spawned A, probably, and he's shooting you in your back. So, yeah. Okay. I mean, sometimes it'll work out, but once again, fundamentally wrong. Um, I want that to go through your head. Like, you can't, can't just, like, rely on, like, bad habits and stuff to, like, just not work. I mean, granted, it worked, but don't rely on that. So in this rank, 
It seems this it seems like this is like plat. Like high plat, low, really low diamond. At this point, I would sack this hill. <laughs> I would sack this hill and then invest into um like a shock rifle or some kind of utility or like some kind of weapon power position, maybe play for the next hill. That's what I would be doing. I'd say F this hill, this hill's pointless because dude, they need like a second on it. Um, if you guys get this hill, it'd be crazy. <coughs> but yeah, you're gonna die here. Oh my god, you guys are gonna get it. Holy crap, that is crazy. You literally ran into the hill like five times. Your last five deaths, you've just been like openly running into the hill and you guys still won that hill. That is crazy. It, it, is, it is what it is. We'll, we'll, take, we'll take it. Whatever, man. I like your name, by the way, Halo Lover. It's a good name. Good or not. But it is. Nice. Right, take up space on the map. Good. Um, and you know that there's gonna this is kind of suicidal because you don't know where anyone is. Luckily for you, you can just outkill people. So it's like whatever. Good job on taking up space on the map. You're spawning your teammates close. Good. Nice. Um, and they're just like retard mode running into it, so good. Nice, dude. BR supremacy. Let's go. Good. This is good. Taking up the map. F the objective, bro. Someone else can do the objective. Unless you really have to do the objective, someone else can do it. Um, you're probably gonna get this. Because you just hung around C-plat, spawned your teammates there. Good job. Okay, you're gonna try to take up space on the map. Like to see it. A little bit of a wide angle here. If that player was good, you'd be dead. Um. Okay, and he just lacks object permanence for some reason. He just completely forgot you existed. Your teammate in top white doesn't even realize you were freaking killing someone. Okay, whatever, man. Um, it works. You're out killing. Good. You can out kill, and fundamentally, you are you are taking up space on the map, which is good. Um, but you gotta play your shields a little bit uh, better. Uh, you're half HP in the middle of the open map, so it is what it is. And this is fine. You can walk out here, uh, because your team has so much semblance of control. Uh, you're gonna have to push through. Good. They're spawning A. Doesn't matter anymore. The hill's hill's gone. I would just straight up leave this area because it's pointless to be here. Now. Um, you took like the long way around. I know you saw that guy. I would straight up. I like. I'm being real here. Ignore him. Like if he was like trying to like play with you here, um, ignore him. I would straight up just leave. Like just go, man. Cause like you don't you don't need to be here. If anything, it's a detriment to be here because you're you could possibly spawn your teammates close to here, and that's not what you want to do for this next hill because it's on C plat. So yeah, um, and you took the long way around. I straight up would have just left. Oh. And uh, play back here, back out. Don't even peek that. Nice, good, very good discipline. Um, I probably wouldn't do this though, dude. You're one HP. Where are you going? Do you, do you have information? Because, like, if someone was here, you would got one tapped. So, I get what you're going for, but, like, a like, little patient. You, you did some good discipline in the beginning, but, bro, be a little more patient. Luckily for you, these guys are literally children, and they don't understand, like, that you're shooting them in the back this entire time. Um, so, whatever. We'll take this. Um, and it looks like wraps pretty much. Uh, your mechanics are decent for your rank. Um, so there's nothing really to talk about besides what I've always been preaching, you know, practice, um, intentional aim, that kind of thing. Um, I really like your, um, your way of doing map control. You don't just rush the objective. I like to see that. So good job. You just have to think about like fundamental, like game sense stuff as in like like the stuff in the beginning where i was like what's the point of getting into white you know taking up space on the map playing stuff that your guy is getting mauled on the left right here you should go help him for sure he literally died he was like i don't know what he was fighting but you should definitely go <laughs> go help him um but it's all right like your teammates are dying okay whatever we just bait our teammates let's go dude 
detected. Uh, you should probably check your right. They are so far. Yeah, okay. At this point, you are doing nothing right now. Like, you're just standing here for no reason. Um, go out. Go out this way. So you can see what's going on, you know what I mean? You're doing nothing. You're just, like, watching the hill. Um, there's a guy right there. Now you're baiting the hell- you're baiting your teammates, like, really hard. Um, which isn't necessarily bad, but, like, at least get something out of it, you know what I mean? This is dangerous. Um, but this game looks pretty wrapped, so I'm not gonna lie. Their team cannot... Their team is bad. Let's get out, dude. You're, you leave your teammate. See, okay. See, this is the thing. I hate to say it, but like, if this, if any of these players were good, if this player was good, and this player was good, you would die. Um, you would, you like, say that even if they whiff their shots, you would die by doing this. Like, you would die by doing this, um, going over here, because he would read, he would read that you are doing this, that you're gonna go around it and try to go for a flank. Um, I would. Uh, uh, like where like where else are you gonna go like do you have the discipline to just sit back no you're gonna walk around if that guy was good if your team was if their team was good then they would have saw that coming but luckily for them or sorry not luckily for them luckily for you they lack object permanence so it's whatever um and this game kind of just it doesn't matter at this point like it looks wraps they're they're so mentally like gone like no i don't think anybody on their team like cares to even fight for this anymore and it's wraps all right so yeah uh that's my vod review for this one but uh good job um i there's things i see that are good there's some things that you need to work on um if you want to climb to like a higher rank you got to start be think you got to start thinking about the mind game and stuff.